this stone crop, why don't you like the huntsman? I might sound childish, but I just don't. Ever since he came here, I never liked him. Well, did he do something bad to you or anything like that? I don't know if he ever's done a bad thing in his life, to be honest. Though, I can't help but feel that he's capable of it. Every time I look in his eyes, something just doesn't feel right to me. Hmm. Everyone in Pokery seems to like him, but maybe... <sighs> Wolves! No, I'll get back. More are coming. They're even bigger than before. Damn it. No, I need to stay and protect the village. You have to go on, I'll be fine. I'm sorry. Miss, Miss Stonecrop. Don't worry about me. Get to your grandmother's house. But now. Oh, it changed. Buttonbush Woods. This is nice. Taking a stroll. <laughs> or not. What was that? Oh, you got to be kidding me. It's those wolves. Did they get to... No, I need to get to Grandma's house. I can't hunt with them with this crummy axe. There's something inside the trunk. Pepper... Pepper pear juice? Okay, whatever. I'll take it. Oh. Grandma! Lenora, is that you? What's the matter, dear? Grandma, are you still alright? A pack of wolves just attacked the village. Goodness, child. I'm fine, but you look terribly exhausted. You should rest a while, my dear. Alright, dear. Once more from the beginning. Wolves attacked the village just hours ago, and I'm afraid that they overwhelmed Miss Stonecrop. I must go to the huntsman. He's the only one who can help us now. Wolves always were a problem with the Hollow, but I've never heard of them attacking the villagers so directly like this. Something must be making them act so strangely, don't you think? Certainly not normal. In any case, I agree that finding a strong, brave hunter is the only choice we have, but is it really safe for you to go alone? Well, Miss Stonecrop taught me how to hunt. I'm no huntress, but I've already killed three of them today. There are even bigger ones outside though, and the axe I have right now is too weak to do the job. You need a stronger axe, you say? Well, you're in luck, my dear. I have a nice, sturdy firewood axe you may borrow. If it can split wood, it can split wolf skulls. <laughs> yeah. Well, thanks. Let me go fetch you. Right, Crick? Here you are, darling. You'll be better use of this than your old grandma. Wait, you're, you are Huntress? Or something? Or were you just cutting wood? I'll also bake some pastries you can take with you. Make sure you keep yourself nourished. Buttermilk pie slice, five of them. Mmm. Grandmama's cooking was always the best. Bottled water. Thank you, Grandma. I'll return as soon as I'm able. Remember, wolves are fearsome. Cunning creatures. Even if they are rabid, they deserve our respect. Nah. Nah. The only time they get my respect. Can you- are you gonna let me go? Thank you. Seriously, I wanna- I'm- I'm going back in. Did you see how many wolves are out there? I don't even know what my health is. Oh god, you- I wasn't meant to talk to you, I was meant to look at the menu. <laughs> Your mother is always worrying about me. I think she keeps forgetting that the strength of survival is rooven in our blood. I'll be waiting a ray in my deathbed before I let some trite little wolf bring me down. <laughs> Oh, my HP is full. Okay, that's great. PP is 15 out of 25. I don't even know what my PP is. Hurts kind of bad. A special but weak axe chop. Well, that's wonderful. Steady swing. Firewood split. A head splitting axe chop hits one. You mean hits one? Oh. Stife sweep. Hits all prey hard. Don't mess up. I don't want to go outside, but... <sighs> okay. Trini! Only 
just caught Trini. <laughs> Jesus Christ, you're hurting me. I'm glad it wasn't successful. Do I have some sort of EXP? I don't, I just have health. Okay. F sake. F sake, I didn't want to do that. I can't even want to ray. I swear if I miss. Oh. Yes, I got something for HP. I think it's HP, it better be HP. Good it is. Chalk very thick. Just on a pure dodging skill right there. I don't need to kill every single one of them. North to Huntsman Cabin, rest to um, Buttonbush Woods, but for uh, a Huntsman Cabin, I guess. Huntsman, are you in? It's Lenora Clement. Clement? Well, you know, my last name. It's not important right now. Is he not home? His door is unlocked. Maybe he fell asleep. Well, sleeping can wait. The village needs help now. Oh no. Is he really not home? Let's go steal these things. What am I going to do now? I might, I might have to do it alone. Well, I ought to look around in here before I leave. This cabin must have some provision I can borrow for the trip home. Like I said, to steal his stuff. This mill is still warm and untouched. Where could the huntsman have gone? Probably got scared. Just like everyone else. It looks like a lumberjack axe. That should be much more useful than the axe grandma gave me. No answer. The door is locked too. This probably leads to the pantry in any case. Great, awesome. All healed up. Oh, holy crap. Oh no, that wolf looks huge and I can bet that there's more out there. Where are they all coming from? Might be able to handle a few of them, but things don't look good at all. I need to check on grandma before I reach the village. I need to go back to her? Like, seriously? She, oh, she was that far back. Did, 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 nope. <laughs> Grandma, I've returned. Back so soon? Were you able to find a huntsman, dear? No, Grandma. He wasn't in his cabin, and I haven't the slightest idea where he could be. But I don't have time to wait for him to save us. There are ferocious wolves out there. The villagers is... Oh, sorry, not villagers. The village is lost if I don't leave them, right? If I don't leave them. <laughs> the village is lost if I don't leave right away. Serious as this may be, you'll be wolf chow if I let you leave like this. Rest of while, Lenore. Snore, snore, sleep, sleep. Woo! Alright then, time for you to leave, dear. Yes, I'm afraid so. I hope I can do this. Be cautious and cunning, Lenore. Fearsome as the wolves may be, they're just as lost as we are. By the way, Take some extra vision with you. You are so kind. Thank you, Grandma. Oh, 
it seems quite peaceful now. Oh, Huntsman! Um, are you crying? Well, look who we have here. Hello, little Lenora. Visiting your grandmother, were you? What a good girl you are. Huntsman, I was looking all over the forest for you. Where had you gone? I was out doing what I do best, my girl. What's gotten you in such a fuss? Stung by a wasp again? Huntsman, Rokri the Hollow has been overrun by wolves. You need to come with me right away. We have to get rid of them. The Hollow is overrun by wolves? Is it? Well, you and I will have to rectify that, won't we? Come along then. We have much to do. Wait, where are you going? Back to my cabin, of course. Your cabin? We don't have time for that. Trust me. Little Colonel Mint, this wolf problem won't be solved by rushing to the village like a couple of silly knights. Let's get going now. We won't get anything done jordling around in the woods like this. I don't trust him now. I think he's just trying to lead me away. Please remind me why we're here instead of the village. Dear little Lenore, I've already told you why. Simply killing the ones in the village won't stop this. Then how do we stop their attacks? Wolves may be packed hunters, but they always have a leader. I have wanted to this pack big or bad alpha wolf before. He's an old nemesis of mine, but it looks like his time has come, doesn't it? I suppose so. As long as we can do it quickly, there really isn't much time left. We? Oh no, little Noah. I'm going it alone. What do you mean? I'm not going to stay here and do nothing. Nonsense. You'll be killed the moment you step outside. Excuse me. I don't think so. I can take care of myself. So, back off and let me do my thing. Come on, this is Clementine can do stuff. It's safer to stay here in the cabin. Huntsman, I've hunted a whole pack of wolves by now. Um, actually, I've hunted about maybe five, six. I can handle myself. Well, that may be. I don't want to put you in danger any longer. It would be irresponsible. Your mother would have my head. Here. You can have my spare hunting axe. I kind of already stole your axe, to be completely honest. If it will make you feel safe. Given a huntsman axe. No, you don't have an axe anymore. I, I took all your axes right now. <laughs> also, should a stray wolf break in here, a little trick to end its life quickly. Head the wolf. Oh, that sounds like a cool skill. Huntsman, I appreciate everything you've done for me, but I can't help but feel like I need to go with you. I know, little Clement. This is a stressful time for you, for everyone. But don't you worry your pretty little head off. I'll serve all of this once and for all. Have some treats to hold you over the night. I should be back morning with a brand new wolf pelt cloak. I'm not a child. I don't need treats. I just need my grandma's food. Because I like her. Apple butter pastry. Uh, oh, pasty. Okay, I kind of like you. Bubble milk tea. Uh, uh, yeah, I still like you. Alright then, I'm off. I still don't trust you. Try to get some rest. You've had a long day, little Lenore. You're trying to kill my family. He's gone. I still feel like I need to go after him. For some reason, staying behind doesn't feel safe to me at all. Should I stay or should I go? Freaking go. I should go. I should go. I'm going. There are too many wolves out there for one person to handle, experienced hunter or not. Hell yeah, let's do this. Damn it! <laughs> Damn, I look so freaking awesome right now from the first animation I had. He's defending good. I can see what you got. 25. I can handle that. forest I 
I'm liking all these different colours every time you go somewhere. Oh, what? It splits off into two? How am I going to know where to go? There's a wolf coming right at me. I can't. I can't pass it. Oh, yes, I can. Yes, skills. Little Red Riding Hood gets through. She breaks and runs into a tree. Because she says she doesn't know how to get past trees, but she can get past wolves. Sweet! Nope. I ain't got time for this. I've got to save the huntsman because he's a jackass. Or he's planning something. I need to see what he's planning. Actually, maybe I've gone the complete wrong way because I, I don't remember... You know, him saying, hey, go over here. I just remember exiting. I've gone the wrong way, haven't I? I was meant to go to the village, weren't I? Oh, this is nice and welcoming. What happened to the huntsman? Oh, no. It, it ate the huntsman. I can't do this. I can't do this. Where am I going to? How can I? No, I've come too far. There's no turning back. Yes, there is.